Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today I've got a product that was introduced to me by a friend and a former mentor. And it's something I had no clue existed. Probably most of you don't either. Very inexpensive. It's right here, guys. You can find it on Amazon.com. But let's go ahead and take a look and see what we got. All right, so this particular one that I have is by brand Foshio. There are several other different companies that have these. And I'm talking about plastic razors. Plastic razors, guys. Didn't even know such a thing existed. And it comes with a whole bunch of plastic replacement blades. These things look and feel kind of like an actual razor blade, much safer. How many of you have been cut by those, those metal scraper blades? And how many pieces of medical equipment have been damaged by those metal scraper blades? I can, look at this, I can actually scrape off imperfections right here on the plot, in the, uh, the cardboard. Look at that, how crazy. They are sharp, but not technically sharp enough. I, I suppose maybe you could cut yourself Let's go ahead and let's take a look and see on an unprepped surface how these little blades can do. All right, so right here, I have a PM sticker that's been on here for a while and it's unprepped, which means I have no goo gone sprayed on there like you would typically do. So that means the adhesive is really stuck on there. This is stainless steel. Everybody knows stickers love stainless steel. Let's see how it does. Well, considering how stuck on there it is. Dang, that's doing a bang up job. Look at that. No scratches on the metal. The sticker rolled up nice and beautifully. There is some adhesive left over, but that's where the goo gong comes in. So you have some sort of rag that you have soaked in the orange oil. You go ahead and clean up that surface as you should normally do during PMs, and you're ready to keep going. Look at this tape. You can scrape that tape right off. Very cool. So in the particular kit that I have, there are two of these plastic scrapers. So you can outfit two technicians or two tool bags at the same time. And there's like a hundred of these plastic blades. Look at these. And the blades are double-sided, just like traditional razor blades. So when you use up one side, you can flip it over and you can put three or four of these in your uh, tool bag. I imagine that these have many other uses, but holy cow, how cool is that? And to switch out the blade, let's see, all I do is, yep, bend the blade down a little bit, and it pops right out, flip it around, just like so. And the cool thing is, I don't have to worry about cutting myself. How many of you guys have been out there using metal razor blades and if you accidentally cut yourself, you have no clue where that blade has been historically. It's probably been in some pretty ganky areas. So there you go. You got two blades. You can outfit them. Two technicians, two tool bags. You got a whole bunch of replacement blades. Probably enough to last you a couple of years. Guess what? The best part is this kit, two of these plus all the blades, costs less than $10 on Amazon. Yes! I'm gonna go ahead and leave a link in the video description where you can check them out. There's also metal handled versions of these, but I kind of like the plastic version. They're really small and compact. They fit in a tool bag really nicely, and they're lightweight. Actually, they, they actually have a little bit of heft to them. That's, that's dense plastic. But, I mean, this is a real solution. Plastic blades, yes, finally. I love it. Anyway, guys, go ahead and check it out. Link down below, you can get them yourself. This is a far safer alternative, and also, you're not scraping and gouging medical equipment. Scrapes and gouges in medical equipment cannot be remedied other than sanding it down. Sanding down, it actually involves more gouges. Gouges can be an infection control hazard. Something to think about, guys. Check them out, plastic scrapers. Thanks for watching.